and this is the second part <laughs> I'm gonna keep going it's been 40 minutes of recording already oh we found the delusion factory what um it's a domain isn't it oh boy delusions cannot be allowed to spread throughout inazuma you will not stand by idly and watch fire water electric i don't think it's that tough i think it's fine let's go look for the person running the factory What the hell? Oh. What the heck? Okay, I can break this. Okay, there's Alpha 2E, definitely. Hold up, this are. Uh, okay. Now I see why I might need water. <laughs> but never mind, it's fine. Okay, it's an elevator. So, is this what the legends are made from? Crystal Mary? Wait, what? So the Kanja Commission are... Uh... Oh yeah, they said they need Crystal Marrow. What? This is order. Order Kanja. Very good. Oh, this thing. Take this. Take this thing. And okay, this guy I really need like water, but I don't have it. I don't have Barbara. <laughs> there you go. The music. I just realized. <laughs> it's the usual music, but it's in Azuma version. Oh boy! Not with that machine. Oh! This place is really dangerous, huh? What is this? What? Just to be sure? <laughs> okay, I got two amulets. Oh, we're back here, I see. Dot of resurrection of a two shoot. Harbingers. Who are your harbingers? Oh gosh, not the healing guy. Is this water? Yeah, this is the healing guy. I 
The tourist people in what? Who are these guys? Okay, how Wow, level 69, no problem. Oh, is this enemy? I fought before. I have fought this before. No worries. this to uh, take this no don't okay got damage I can yeah there you go there you go <laughs> Scarab Moose? Congratulations. Uh so you're another Fatui Harbinger? Like Senora and Child? Senora and Child. <laughs> I didn't know you and my two least reliable. So this is another harbinger. I'm the Balladeer. Number six. Number six of the Fatui Harbingers. Delighted to meet you. Oh mighty traveler. So many visitors today. To what do I owe the honor? Oh, so that's what this is about. I think you've got the wrong idea. Hmm? I know how this looks, but I'm just here to follow orders. I'm obviously not the mastermind behind this. Aren't you supposed to be pretty tough? What are you waiting for? Go get them. You're getting all worked up over nothing. <sighs> Didn't have you down as being so weak. How can you say this is nothing? How can you call it anything more? It's the way of the world. Human life is worthless. They were always going to die. With or without a delusion. At least having one gives them a chance to fulfill their ambitions. Do you have any idea how useful the Vision Hunt decree is to us? It took a lot of work to make it happen. Obviously, it, took it was a lot of work our to best make it interest. So the Vision Hunt decree is the Fatui's idea. Good news is, our hard work is finally paying off. Is Generating it? conflict creates a big market for delusions. Now we just let the promise of power draw in the weak. For just a small price, they get the feeling of controlling the world. Trading their life for supreme power. Pretty good deal, don't you think? So, the Fatui started hmm. the vision on decree? You've been behind it all along? From the outside, Inazuma looks pretty impenetrable. But on the inside, it's a land of opportunity. With a little effort, we were able to break them down from within. Eternity stretches things out over a long time. But each moment within it becomes all the more fragile. Take your friend in the resistance, for example. There's nothing you can do now. How did you... He's a lost cause. How did you know the friend in the resistance? Just like a bubble on the water. Beautiful for a moment. Than total destruction. I have a feeling these things, this smoke thing might be a bit dangerous. So we're actually The more it takes from them, the more tightly they hold on to it. And the more incompetent they are, the more determined they are to fight it. <laughs> it's guy. such a farce. You have to see the funny side. Hey, calm down! Wait, are we fighting him? Uh, no! Oh no. Oh shit. Is this a delusion? Yet? Wait, what? That's it. Just like that. Embrace the anger. Embrace it! The wrath of the gods fills this factory and it feeds on your anger. <laughs> Hmm? 
Il y a un unico What What was the Aimiko doing there? Nani? And now what? Repeat after me. Three, two, one. One, two, three. <sighs> Come on. Alright. Okay, that's positive. Your brain seems relatively unscathed. This is good news. So, it's just as well, really, yeah, with the amount of effort this? it took me to get you back here. Honestly, it was like you were glued to the ground back there. Uh, Nico? Paimon's been wanting to ask you about something. Hmm? Uh, how come you're acting so differently from when we first met you? Am I? Maybe it's because I had the other shrine maidens leave. Anyway, I've always been like this. People show you whatever side of themselves they want you to see. I know this for a fact. Every side of me is the real me. People just like to define things in all sorts of arbitrary ways. This is a human society. At the moment, anyway. And I'm just doing as I please. Uh, I didn't quite follow. <laughs> Study humans a while longer, my little friend. You'll see what I mean. How did you save me from the Baladir? Great! Paimon was so focused on the Traveler that Paimon didn't notice what you did to get Scaramouche off our backs! What if I told you it was a secret art from the Grand Narukami Shrine? A secret art? And that I had the Baladir down on his knees, begging what? for mercy in an instant. Would you believe me? I didn't see that. <laughs> <laughs> well... Maybe you should be worrying less about that, and more about how exactly you're going to thank me, no? Hmm. Maybe some of your neural circuitry is less intact than I thought. I didn't mean you had to be so formal about it. I need your actions, not your words. <laughs> hmm. The delusions. They're still on your mind, aren't they? What happened next? You needn't worry. The leader of Watatsumi Island took some troops to clear the place out. She's also issued a strict ban on the use of delusions across the whole army. With their stronghold exposed, I doubt the Balladeer is stubborn enough to try and retaliate now on his colleague's behalf. It would be more trouble than it's worth. Ah, <sighs> I must say, I would relish the opportunity to watch the Fatui getting a taste of their own medicine. Well, anyway, that's Ongonomiya Kokomi. She really outdid herself this time. I'd love to have another chat with her again in person. But alas, belief systems can be such a hindrance sometimes. A hindrance? Should you really be saying that as the Gucci of the Grand Shrine? Anyway, I'm only telling you this to stop you worrying so that you can focus. On something I need you mm -hmm. to do for me. What do you need? You've met her, right? Pride and Shogun? Yes. I'm not talking about the puppet. I mean her. Puppet? You've met her, yes? You mean inside, in that place? What do you mean puppet? Yes, the true Raiden Shogun. Who meditates endlessly in the plane of Euthymia to preserve her being. Her name is A. A. I I kind of heard of that already. Are you saying that the one we met at the ceremony was just a puppet? And the real Raiden Shogun is the one that the Traveler met later? Uh, a puppet? Oh. <sighs> because this is the ride in Shogun's eternity. Before pursuing the eternity of her nation, she had to reach eternity for herself. Since the physical body will eventually turn to dust, she replaced hers with that of a puppet. And since the spirit is susceptible to erosion, she placed her consciousness inside her sword, consciousness where she remains in a sword. meditative state. Free from all disturbances. So, that place that she carved open with her sword. 
the plane of Euthymia. Essentially, mm, the time. world inside her mind. A place that typically only allows her That's why we suddenly went to another dimension. That is the plane of Euthymia? She shuts herself off in her inner world, leaving all the affairs of the outside world to be dealt with by a puppet who has a singular focus on the pursuit of eternity. Ooh. Huh. This is the approach A has come up with for realizing eternity. You mean Morax? Uh -huh, yeah. Hmm, it's been a while since I last saw him. A surprising decision by Liu as Archon. What a fascinating god he is. It seems like the Raiden Shogun's approach solves the problem Zhang Li was facing, though. <laughs> Perhaps. Or you could take the view that she's acting like a little child. Throwing a temper tantrum and locking herself in her room, don't you think? <laughs> I'll put it that way. The grand notion of eternity she once held has long since given way to the eternity of her own definition, and ultimately, her eternity is defined by fear the fear of loss. The truth is, we are on the same side. You want to save the people of Inazuma from the Vision Hunt Decree. So do I. The only difference is that I'd rather like to save this nation and save A while we're at it. The key is that the Plane of Euthymia represents A's inner world. Defeat her there and you may well have the chance to shake the Raiden Shogun's will. So this is your plan? To abolish the Vision Hunt Decree? Not by talking her out of it? Or through an armed resistance? By uh, hopping inside the Raiden Shogun's well, inner world? We kind of have already went into the inner world. We just had to f go again. You're a fast learner. In short, this is the last chance to get Inazuma back on track. Otherwise, an eternity of darkness awaits. One question, why me? Don't you realize how special you are? Remember, the plane of Euthymia is a space where only she is allowed to exist. The fact that you could appear there tells us one crucial thing. Oh, she is allowed. Um... That you have piqued her interest. Perhaps it's because she has never seen an individual who is so unpredictable in the face of eternity. Has no one else ever been in there? None. No None. one has seen the devotee of eternity since she shut herself away. In fact, no one even knows what it looks like in there. Your existence is more than just an opportunity. It's the very key to all of this. To that I say, well done, child. You did not disappoint me after all. Wait, you're leaving? Where are you going? Anti Raiden Shogun training. <laughs> I've prepared a special program show. just for you. Come along. All right. We're back up here. Go to the training area. We're gonna do some training. Huh? Hold on. Let me get to this. Uh, I wanna check how much already. Um. Okay. Still level nineteen. Anyway, yeah. Go to the training area. Let's go. Wait, is it on the top? We're gonna do it here? Uh, and what's this mechanism for? Think of it as a catalyst that can reproduce the Raiden Shogun's combat move. Reproduce. I made it from my own memory, which means it should be perfectly accurate. <laughs> Unless, of course, her skills have declined. It'll give you a chance to figure out her moves in advance and come up with a counter strategy. Oh. That should be a big help, don't yeah, you Yeah, that think? would be a big help. It's like fighting the bosses again and again so you know their moves. The aim is to try to not get hit by the attacks. Since you've escaped certain death at her hand once already, I presume there shouldn't be more than you can handle. Alright, um... 
Complete the entire Raiden Shogun training. Okay. Uh, start challenge, activate the final challenge. Why is there two options? Avoid being hit by finishing. Wow! What? Okay. What the heck? What? Okay, these are her moves, eh? Ooh. Ah, what? Oh my gosh. Maybe I need Zhongli to shield myself for that part. Alright, you know what? Can I do that? No, I'll still get hit. The stick counter is getting hit. Ah! I'm just running around. How do you... What? Oh, this is... Oh, I know this move. What the hell? You weren't kidding. This is exactly like fighting Raiden Shokan. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Um. Well, I did not. There is no fighting. We're just avoiding. So I don't really need. Wish me luck. I did not expect that. So a shield is useless. Maybe just to survive, but that's not the final challenge. Let's just start challenge. Stabilize. Oh my gosh. So this is her moves. What was that? Ah! Ah! Oh, I avoided that. <laughs> okay, three lightning moves. Oh, this is a big one. That one I cannot avoid. Whoa. Okay, I don't know what that move was. That was, it was one of those slashes, I think. That was a slash move. Oh, okay, the range one I just have to stay away from. You. Ah, this one I have to destroy one of these things. Okay. What? That counts as damage? Adventure time. Um. Nico? Hmm? What's stopping you? <laughs> Not still traumatized from your last encounter, are you? Okay, well, this is gonna take a while. Well, this is training, I guess. Perfect training. <sighs> Alright. Actual training. <laughs> Let's do this again. Alright, that one I don't know how to avoid. This one, okay, I just have to dash. Ah, uh, and stay away. Okay, this one just run. That's the slash move. Yes. Okay. What next? Okay, that's good. Gather. Ah, the slash. Another slash. And another slash. Okay, there's three slashes. Now what? Oh! How do you avoid this one? Oh, wait. I... Did I pass it? Oh! <laughs> okay! Um... There's still the final challenge though. What a workout! 
It was a little challenging, actually, yeah. So how come you know so much about the Raiden Shogun? Hmm? You mean me? Hmm. Mm, perhaps it's because I'm the Electro Archon's familiar. What? Like Devalin is to Barbados? Yeah, like a companion, huh. right? Never would have guessed by looking at you. I had a feeling. <laughs> Sounds like you'd be more persuaded if you saw me in my fox form. Fox form? In your dreams. <laughs> in your dreams. I think there's a meme about this. <laughs> more curious than my appearance is the fact that she and I don't see each other anymore, wouldn't you say? A nation to last for all eternity is a dream that she and I both share. But I don't think that's the same thing as complete stasis. At some point, she started going down a path that became increasingly difficult for me to join her on. You know, A never said goodbye to me before she stepped into the plane of Euthymia. Perhaps it's just my wishful thinking, but I think she did this deliberately as her way of keeping our friendship eternal. Eternal. By neither saying goodbye nor seeing me again, our relationship will remain forever how it was. In her mind, at least. Since we've embarked on two very different paths to eternity, I can either continue to maintain the status quo or do whatever it takes to bring her back on track, regardless of the cost. I have chosen the latter because... If stubbornly isolating herself in the plane of Euthymia is her idea of eternity, then my duty as her eternal familiar is to drag her back out of her own head and into the real world. Aw, Nico. You sound like a really great friend. <laughs> I'm only telling you this so you can properly understand my plan. Could you possibly spare the sentimentality for the time being? Anyway, that's enough chit chat. Time for anti Raiden yeah. Shogun training phase two. I know there's a phase two. There's a part two? Yep, I saw the final challenge just now. What is that about? Oh boy, here we go. Isn't the phase 2 where you get sealed, the movements? Is it, is it that one? Wait, defeat 10 opponents. Wait, we are, we are fighting while avoiding, is it? Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, where's the move? No? Oh, I was gonna. Oh, but this is no avoiding. Okay, good. I don't have to avoid. It's just fight ten opponents while these attacks are coming. All right. Ready? <laughs> what? The? Well, I have shields this time, so this makes it easier. I will have order. Yeah, that was way easier because I don't have to avoid. <laughs> No match for her either. <laughs> You're absolutely right. Perhaps they occasionally best the Shogun's army in open battle. But when they face the Raiden Shogun mm -hmm. herself, considering even their visions have been taken from them and embedded in the statue, yeah. 
they're ultimately quite helpless. You don't have to be so blunt. The Traveler's the captain of Swordfish, too, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't mean to belittle them. On the contrary, it is precisely because of their helplessness, because their visions have been taken from them, that their will is all the more precious. In short, if everything goes according to plan, they may yet prove to be helpful. Yeah, what is the plan? Oh, goodness. Is that the time? I have is that the time? What do you mean? Today. We can talk more about okay. the Grand Narakami Shrine. All right. All of this setting, you're entertaining guests? Huh. <laughs> I'm a really struggling to understand how you work. I guess someone's calling her for her already. Back to the Narukami Shrine, and who's this? I don't know. 